fable story about Pinocchio in the mountains. Once upon a time, there lived a little boy named Pinocchio. He lived in the mountains with his father Geppetto, who was a woodcarver and had made Pinocchio from an enchanted piece of wood. He had dreams of making his puppet's son a real boy someday, but that day had yet to come. Pinocchio, however, was a bit of a naughty boy. He was always wandering off and getting into trouble. One day, while he was out exploring, he stumbled upon a magical land of adventure and excitement. He quickly got lost in the beauty of it all and found himself in a deep, dark forest. As he wandered further, he heard a strange voice calling his name, Pinocchio, come closer. Pinocchio cautiously stepped forward and found himself face to face with a talking cricket. The cricket told Pinocchio that he was in the land of dreams and that he was there to help him find his way back home. She warned him of the dangers of the forest, as well as of the wicked people who wanted to take advantage of him. But she also showed him how to find the courage to face his fears and how to overcome the obstacles that were blocking his way. Pinocchio was touched by the cricket's kindness and guidance, and he soon realized that his journey back home would be a long and difficult one. He faced many challenges along the way, but with the help and guidance of the cricket, he was able to make it back home safely to the loving embrace of Geppetto. This fable story about Pinocchio in the mountains teaches us that, with courage and determination, we can overcome any obstacle and follow our dreams. Pinocchio's journey is proof that, with a little help and guidance, anything is possible. So never give up, and never stop believing.